When you get behind the wheel of a modern car, you're surrounded by electricity. It's truly amazing when you think about it. Your radio, your headlights, the power windows, the air conditioning, and even the engine itself all rely on a complex web of wires and circuits. It's like a miniature city running on its own power grid. Every one of these components needs just the right amount of electrical current to work properly. Too much power and you could have a serious problem on your hands. It's a delicate balance, and keeping that balance is one of the most important jobs in the whole vehicle, even if you never see it happening. Think of it like this. Your car's electrical system is a network of busy highways. The electricity is the traffic, flowing from the battery to all the different destinations, the lights, the horn, the wipers. But just like on a real highway, sometimes you can get a traffic jam or a surge of too many cars at once. In an electrical system, this surge is called a power spike or a short circuit. If that extra electricity reaches a sensitive component, like your car's computer or a delicate motor, it can cause a lot of damage. That's where our unsung heroes, the fuses and relays, come into play to direct traffic and prevent accidents. These little parts are the traffic cops and safety barriers of your car's electrical world. They work silently in the background, usually tucked away in a fuse box under the hood or beneath the dashboard. You might not even know they're there until something stops working, but their job is absolutely critical. They are designed to be the first line of defense, protecting all the expensive and complicated parts of your car from electrical harm. Without them, a simple wiring issue could turn into a catastrophic failure, costing you a fortune in repairs and leaving you stranded on the side of the road. It's a big responsibility for such small components. So, while we all love the shiny paint, the powerful engine and the comfortable seats, it's these tiny, inexpensive guardians that truly keep the whole show running. They are the foundation of modern automotive reliability. They make sure that when you press a button or turn a key, everything works as it should, safely and consistently. For just a few cents, these parts provide invaluable peace of mind. They are a testament to smart engineering, proving that sometimes the smallest components have the most important jobs in the entire machine. They are the reason your car's electrical system doesn't just fry itself. So, what exactly is a fuse? Well, it's one of the simplest and most brilliant safety devices ever invented. Imagine a tiny bridge that is designed to collapse if a truck that's too heavy tries to cross it. A fuse does the exact same thing for electricity. Inside every fuse is a small, thin strip of metal. Electricity flows through this metal strip to get to a specific component, like your car radio. This little strip is carefully designed to handle a certain amount of electrical current and no more. It's a very precise and calculated design, made to protect everything downstream from it. The first automotive fuse wasn't as fancy as the colorful plastic ones we have today. The concept of a fuse has been around since the 1880s, but they started becoming common in cars around the 1920s. Back then, cars had very simple electrical systems, maybe just for headlights and a horn. Early fuses were often simple glass tubes with a metal wire inside. The principle, however, was exactly the same as it is today. They were there to protect those early electrical components from power surges from the generator. It was a revolutionary idea for making cars safer and more reliable for the average person. Here's how the magic happens. If there's a problem in the circuit like a frayed wire causing a short, the amount of electricity flowing through skyrockets. This sudden dangerous surge rushes towards the fuse. Before it can reach and destroy your expensive stereo or engine computer, it hits that thin metal strip inside the fuse. The strip instantly heats up and melts, or blows, breaking the circuit completely. The flow of electricity is stopped dead in its tracks. The fuse essentially sacrifices itself to save the more valuable part it was protecting. It's a noble, one-time act of heroism. This is why fuses are so important. They are a cheap and easy-to-replace part that acts as a failsafe. When a fuse blows, it's a clear signal that something is wrong in that specific circuit. Instead of a costly repair to a major component, you just need to find the source of the problem and then pop in a new fuse for a few cents. That little piece of plastic and metal just saved you from a massive headache and a much lighter wallet. It's the ultimate form of cheap insurance for your car's electrical health, working silently until the moment it's needed most. Now let's talk about the fuse's partner in crime, the relay. If a fuse is a safety barrier, a relay is more like a remote-controlled power switch. Think about it. Some parts of your car, like the starter motor or the cooling fans, need a whole lot of electricity to work. You wouldn't want all that high power flowing through the little button on your dashboard, 
or the ignition switch on your steering column, the switch would be huge, get very hot, and wear out quickly. It just wouldn't be practical or safe to run that much current through the passenger cabin of the car. The relay solves this problem beautifully. The first practical electrical relay was invented way back in 1835 by Joseph Henry. But its application in cars came much later, becoming more common as electrical systems grew more complex after World War II. A relay is an electromagnetic switch. It uses a very small amount of electricity to control a separate, high-power circuit. So, when you press a button to say, turn on your powerful fog lights, you're not actually completing the main circuit yourself, you're just sending a tiny electrical signal to the relay, telling it to do the heavy lifting for you. Here's the clever part. Inside the relay, that small signal powers a tiny electromagnet. When the magnet turns on, it pulls a metal arm, which closes a switch on a completely different high-power circuit. This allows the large amount of current from the battery to flow directly to the fog lights, starter motor, or whatever needs it. When you turn the dashboard switch off, the small signal stops, the electromagnet deactivates, a spring pulls the arm back, and the high power circuit is broken. It's a simple, brilliant way to let a small safe switch control a big, powerful device from a distance. So, the relay acts as a middleman, or a manager, for your car's electricity. It keeps the high current wiring short and contained, usually in the engine bay, away from the driver and sensitive controls. This makes the car safer by reducing the risk of electrical fires inside the cabin. It also allows car designers to use smaller, more delicate, and more reliable switches on the dashboard. Without relays, our car interiors would be filled with chunky industrial strength switches, and the wiring would be an absolute nightmare. The relay is a key player in making modern cars both functional and safe. Together, fuses and relays form a dynamic duo that is fundamental to your car's health and safety. The fuse is the protector, always on watch and ready to sacrifice itself to prevent damage from an electrical overload. The relay is the controller, safely managing the flow of high power to the components that need it most. They work hand in hand. A relay often controls a high current circuit, and that very same circuit will be protected by a high amperage fuse. One manages the flow, and the other ensures that flow never gets dangerously out of control. It's a perfect partnership in electrical engineering. Imagine driving your car without these components. Every time you started your engine, a massive surge of current would flow through your ignition switch. Turning on your headlights would send high power through a flimsy stalk on your steering wheel. A small wiring issue caused by a bump in the road could send a power spike straight to your car's main computer, bricking it instantly. Your car would be incredibly unreliable and frankly quite dangerous. The risk of electrical fires would be immense, and simple functions we take for granted would become a gamble every time you use them. The beauty of these parts is their simplicity and effectiveness. They allow for the incredibly complex electrical systems that power our modern vehicles. Think of all the features in a new car. Heated seats, infotainment screens, dozens of sensors, power folding mirrors, advanced driver assistance systems. None of it would be possible, or at least not safely possible, without a well-organized system of fuses and relays to protect and control every single circuit. They are the building blocks that allow for all this amazing technology to coexist and function reliably every single day, in all kinds of conditions. So the next time you turn your key, your lights pop on, and your engine roars to life, Give a little nod to the humble fuse box and the relays hidden within. These inexpensive, often forgotten parts are the true unsung heroes of automotive electrical systems. They are the reason your car runs smoothly, safely, and reliably. They prove that in a machine as complex as a car, it's often the smallest, simplest components that do the most important work, keeping you safe and on the road. They are the guardians of the grid, and your car simply couldn't run without them.